Shortly after Ackroyd's birth, following the tradition passed down in his family, an encounter with his deceased great-grandparents occurred, I remember my mother recounting a time when she was nursing me, and an elderly couple appeared at the foot of the bed. That image faded away. My mother then took out an album and identified that couple as my great-grandparents, and, their wife, who had come to give their approval to the newborn, since his childhood, Ackroyd's father entertained him with tales of his great-grandfather's spiritual sessions, including experiences of a family medium who could make contact with a variety of individuals from beyond. His father's fascination with the paranormal was so deep that in 2009, he published a book described as an encyclopedia on the subject, titled A Ghost Story, Ackroyd, who still resides in the family home to this day, has described a significant spiritual activity there, with numerous friends and relatives who have spent the night reporting sensations of invisible hands tidying the sheets at night. Ackroyd's paranormal experiences are not limited solely to the old farmhouse. However, during his time living in his former home in California, which was once owned by Mama Cass, Ackroyd encountered various situations, stating that, undoubtedly a spirit haunts my abode. It even once climbed into my bed. The spirit also switches on the stairmaster and moves the jewelry on the dresser. I am convinced it's Mama Cass, as there's a sense of a substantial spiritual presence. While admitting not to possess particular clairvoyant abilities, Ackroyd has asserted that his most frequent paranormal experiences take the form of vivid dreams involving departed friends, and he often senses the returning energy of his friend John Belushi.